Hey, buddy, I'll be out of your way in a minute. You guys can eat. There's the other one over there. So here's a still picture of the Orly gig I did. I got this at a garage sale that I uh, just happened to be driving by. I just kind of like the folks artsy, uh, you know, vibe around it. So I grabbed it, thought I would take this thing and copy it to enter in the contest this year. So I made this, uh, spared no expense actually, made this little stand with a nail in it to hold it up so I could play around with it a little bit and get a feel for how it worked. So I basically wound up taking this thing and stripping it all apart and I think I'm going to take the pieces and just repaint them, sand them down, repaint them, and then I'll have two of these. I'll just give one away to the family or something like that, but there it is. I mean, it's kind of folk, like I said, folk artsy and kind of, I just thought it was kind of cool. So I took this guy and copied it and stuck it out in the yard and here it is. So we didn't have any wind that day and I actually did not have a fan to put in front of it. So I tried to get my uh, yard blower out and I almost pushed it into the pool. So I'm going to gonna play it safe here and just kind of spin it with my hand but it actually does what the other one did so there it is kind of use the same colors that were on the other one um, shorten the screws up a little bit so they don't go you know a mile past the other side there so I just uh, flipped it around by hand um, it actually, when the wind's blowing pretty decent, it works pretty good. I need to touch the paint up on it a little bit. I found out that uh, spray paint dries pretty good. Acrylic paint doesn't. <laughs> so part of this thing getting delayed uh, getting it out was that, uh, man, it was just a pain waiting for the paint to dry. Couldn't even believe it. So I just uh, stabbed it up on that two-inch piece of pipe there that I jammed into the ground and that will be my entry for the Whirly Gig contest this year.